Hey guys, uh, so this is a comparison between the Five Fine AM8 versus the Five Fine K688, and both microphones are actually level across with my mouth. They are not upwards, obviously, because I don't think the audio sounds good upwards. I like to do it this way. But that being said, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to read a passage, uh, the same passage, and you'll see, the video will then repeat, and then you'll hear it on both microphones. Um, so just for a recap, this is the Five Fine K688 right here. And just to recap, this is the Five Fine AM8 right here, and both are level with my mouth. Okay, let's get started. Okay, one, two, three. The small pup not a hole in the sock. The fish twisted and turned on the bent hook, pressed the pants, and sew a button on the vest. The swan dive was far short of perfect. The beauty of the view stunned the young boy. Two blue fish, two blue fish swam in the tank. Her purse was full of useless trash. And just to recap, this is the Five Fine AM8 right here, and both are level with my mouth. Okay, let's get started. Okay, one, two, three. The small pup not a hole in the sock. The fish twisted and turned on the bent hook, pressed the pants, and sew a button on the vest. The swan dive was far short of perfect. The beauty of the view stunned the young boy. Two blue fish, two blue fish swam in the tank. Her purse was full of useless trash. All right, so that's all. Um, hopefully that gives you some context on the differences between both microphones. As with all things, every microphone is going to be different on each person. You may find that the AM8 might sound better than you, for you, or you may find that the K688 might sound better for you. It's not a be all end all. I do think, hey guys, so now I'm on the Shure SM7B and I'm just gonna give you my final thoughts and go from there, as well as this is kind of a comparison that you can hear the SM7B compared to the AM8 and the K688. So in general, I feel like the Five Fine AM8, um, it has a more synthetic sort of V-shaped tone to it, at least to my ears. The second thing I wanna say is, the K688, in my opinion, has more of a woolier, kind of a woolier, kind of muffled tone to it, but I like it. I actually, I think it's actually, uh, you can EQ it. It has hope. You can EQ it. It sounds pretty good. You can EQ it. It sounds, um, it may not work for, I would say, deeper voices, uh, but I think it works for my voice. So I did like the K688 over the AM8. That's my subjective thoughts.